What's up, Persuaders? Today you're going to learn how to uh, create printables to sell, extract tons of traffic from Pinterest, build an e-commerce store using some free software. Okay? So who am I? I'm Mike Paz, and I have over seven years experience creating and selling digital products plus printables online in over, uh, in over a dozen niches. So if you could hear me, if you uh, can see me and all the audio is coming out clearly, please hit, hit the like button. Let me know that everything is coming out and you can uh, see me clearly. Also, let me know where in the world are you watching me from. It's Monday here in Japan. It's about 1 p.m. So it's not Father's Day anymore for me. So what is a printable? A printable is anything you can print out that serves a purpose. The term printable itself gets over a hundred thousand searches a month worldwide. Okay? It's a great product idea because it's versatile and easy to make. You have printable games, calendars, quotes, checklists, journals, printable coloring books, etc. On top of that, you don't have to ship anything. Once the customer buys it, he or she gets access to it instantly. It's up to you as the marketer to pair the niche with the right type of printable. So if you're in the low carb weight loss niche, then a weight loss diet journal might be the ideal product to sell. But before you do anything, you need to do proper keyword research, okay? Go to the free Google Keyword Planner and search the keywords you're interested in. Never, this is really important, never create a product based on what you think the market needs. Find out what the market wants and just give it to them. That's what Google's here for. Not only can we rank on it, Google can tell us what people are searching uh, on a monthly basis. If a keyword product idea gets at least 100 searches a month, then I'll go ahead and create a printable for it or a printable set for it, a set of printables. So you might be asking yourself, how do you create printables? Um, I myself, I don't have any design skills, any artistic talents whatsoever, and I used to outsource it, but now I use a free resource that helps me create printables on the fly quickly and easily. So for the past year, I've been using Canva, canva.com, to get my printables made. It's free and easy to use. Just go to Canva and create a free account. Once in Canva, you'll want to click the A4 option because it's easy for the end user to print out. Also, you can't use Canva's free images for your printables. If you plan to sell anything with the printables you make, do not use Canva's free images, okay? That's going to get you in some legal problems down the line, so don't use Canva's free images. Instead, you need to use public domain images or images you have the rights to. Uh, you can get thousands of public domain images from pixabay.com. Download the images you want and upload them to Canva. Again, Canva is super easy to use. If you can drag and drop, then you can create stunning printables in minutes. After you create a printable you know people want, then it's time to upload it to your e-commerce store. So a lot of people think uh, creating an e-commerce store is, is very difficult and it's not. You can get it done today in 10 minutes, okay? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to explain to you how. So I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily create an e-commerce store. Everyone and their mother is always talking about Etsy and Shopify. Forget them. Their cons outweigh their pros. Okay? You should have your very own e-commerce store. That way, you don't have to pay any fees or share any sales with anyone. Okay? You know, you're with Shopify or you're with Etsy. They take a piece of the action and you have to pay to be on their platform. I, the upside is they have their own traffic. They're, all, they're within themselves many search engines, but they just take too much money. I mean, I recommend that you have your own e-commerce store. Okay? To create an e-commerce store quickly and easily, just install the free WooCommerce plugin to your WordPress blog. So if you have a WordPress uh, blog, then you're 50% there. Follow the WooCommerce wizard setup and you're done. It takes care of everything. If you have a WordPress blog right now, you can have an e-commerce store up in 10 minutes. Just upload your printables 
and images and start sending traffic to them. So that brings me to the next part of this webinar, how to get traffic to your site. Now there are, there are all sorts of ways to get traffic to your site, to your blog, to your products, to your, uh, um, your opt-in forms, whatever. But I'm going to focus on Pinterest, okay? How to get Pinterest traffic. The secret is out. Pinterest is more search engine than social media platform. Plain and simple. Forget hashtags and that follow for follow strategy. That doesn't work on Pinterest. It's all about SEO. So if you pin image, so if you pin images regularly and keyword optimize your account, your board descriptions and pin descriptions, then you will get traffic to your printable products. It's that simple. But uh, I like to save time, so I use two tools to help me out. I use Tailwind and I use my very own pin keyword tool. So if you don't know what Tailwind is, let me explain. It's a paid scheduling service that pins my images at the peak sharing hours for my account. So I'll actually go through my Pinterest account, find out when are, when are the best times, when my audience is most engaged, excuse me, and it will uh, pin my images that I, I've already preloaded in Tailwind onto my Pinterest account, okay? So it's really important to do that. You can do it on your own, and if you want, you can actually get a free account with Tailwind, their free trial. Uh, jot down all of the peak times they give you, and then once the free trial is over, you can do it yourself. But it's, it's really, it takes a lot of time to do that, the pin every day. Uh, I highly recommend you get some kind of scheduler. There's other schedulers out there, but I don't know too much about them. I know that I know Tailwind works for me, and it's, um, it's relatively cheap. I forgot the current price point, but I know that these different scheduling systems, they, they up their price points ever so often, so you should check with that. Tailwind, okay, go to tailwind.com. So uh, yeah, I use Tailwind, because it, again, it shares my pins at the peak hours. So I don't have to keep up with that, I just load them and forget. On top of that, I had a Google Chrome extension created for Pinterest, my very own extension. I was tired of copying and pasting each individual keyword from the Pinterest from the Pinterest search bar okay because you know the Pinterest search bar if you put your keyword in there and you hit backspace it will give you some autofill recommendations this is based on what other people are searching on Pinterest so it's in itself giving you keyword information now before you'd have to copy and paste each keyword and that's a pain okay that takes a lot of time so I had a little uh, Google Chrome extension created that is going to get those keywords right out of the Pinterest search bar and give them to you. And you can, you can get that Chrome extension for free. So it makes all the keywords available to you so you can quickly paste them. You take them, you paste them into your descriptions, into your board descriptions, uh, and when you're setting up your account. You can get my free Chrome extension plus my Facebook Chrome extension at internetmarketinggym.com. Internet Marketing it's all part of my free traffic to profit bundle. It's all about saving time, and these tools automate a lot for me. So now you know where to look for printable product keywords, where to create printables quickly and easily, how to create an e-commerce store in under 10 minutes, and how to get traffic to your printables. If you have any questions, please let me know. Um, I'm going to have all the show notes in a PDF format so you can easily look through what I said today and all the links will be provided within that PDF. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section or reach out to me at internetmarketinggym.com. This is Ike Paz. It's been a pleasure talking at the Persuasion Nation uh, Facebook group. Thank you very much. See you guys. Have a great day. Aye, aye.